Oh, don't. Yeah, I mean, you can do that. That's very playful to uh, to be frozen. <laughs> but then I get concerned of, oh, are we? No, we're actually here. Yeah, Hi, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do one last thing, and that is I'm just going to share it. Uh, I'm just going to share it to my wall. If you want to go to the Velvet Duke page, then you can share it to yours, and there's no pressure about that. But uh, that's the last piece of housekeeping that I get to before I officially talk to the, to the camera. Um, this is also a reminder to myself to talk to the camera. Hi, camera. Uh, <laughs> hey, I can hear myself. Yay. All right. Uh, hi, everybody. I am going to distractedly talk to you, but I want to give you my full attention. So give me the uh, the five seconds here to do this. Share now to friends. There we are. Hi. And now I'm back. Hi, everybody. I am Velvet Wells. This is Yup. And uh, and we are officially live here on Facebook on the Velvet Duke page. And by we, I, I am joined by a guest. But first, for those who are tuning in for the first time, turning in for the tu first time, uh, tuning in for the first time, this is a chill improv set we're going to have. I get to play with people across the globe in various time zones. One of us is just about to go to bed or one of us is just about to get up. Now, as it turns out, I was up super early this morning, so I had a nap uh and my guest may be heading there very shortly uh without further ado i actually would like my guest to introduce themselves please take it away hi i'm bala thank you velvet for having me and as you rightly pointed out it is 10 p.m where i am which is bangalore india um i am an improviser based in bangalore india uh, i improvise with improv comedy bangalore and the adamant eves which is india's first and so far, only all women improv team. That's me. Awesome. That is you. Uh, thank you. And, and we'll talk more about that afterward. But now I just want to get into what we're here to do, which is some chill improv. Uh, some people have already given us suggestions. And mm -hmm. I've randomized it a little bit because there is a there's a habit in our community to give a couple of questions in a, in a burst. So just to split some of those up a little bit, we have nine suggestions for you to pick from. What number would you like? Seven, please. Number seven. Number seven is from Siddharth, and it's colloquial contemporaries. Colloquial okay. contemporaries. Contemporary. Both Got of it. which are great Scrabble words. Let's <laughs> see how it turns as a scene. Uh, we start now. Oh, I'm sorry to have bumped your head. I was reaching down for the papers. I, I'm so sorry. That's okay. Uh, well, as they say in Mysore, don't worry if you bump your head because it means that you're going to get money. So. Oh, I, I love, I love that expression. I, I grew up with the expression, if you bump someone's head, that means you owe them lots of money. Let me get my wallet out here. Uh, do you think uh, uh, $30, would that cover it? Oh, no, I see by your expression. No, 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 no. 30. That's you're right. I, I hit we knocked very, very hard. Um, $50. Yeah, yeah. Great. Yeah, yeah. Great. Thank you. Thank yep. you. Uh, you are forgiven. Um, and I hope none of the uh, gods or goddesses curse you for bumping into me. And um, good luck for the future. I think Thank you. that's what I'm supposed to say. Oh, right? oh, we have followed we have followed the traditions of both of ours so succinctly. Thank you. Uh, I I wish you a good day. I I noticed one of the papers was on the icon the icon, can't say this word the the money stuff ab about spirituality. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah. We call yeah. it the money stuff about spirituality. Also, we don't we don't use those those big words because you yeah. Know, Language grows with the people who speak it. We don't care what it actually means. Uh, you know, just connecting plainly with people is so important. Uh, your essay, sorry. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you so yeah. much. Yes. Uh, that It does sound like an interesting topic. Well, um, it is something that is very close to my heart, Mr. Jenkins. And um, as they say, where I'm from in Mysore, which is the paper about money stuff and spirituality deserves an A plus. And, you know, it's it's a saying. It's it's a saying in from where mm. I am. So, mm. yeah. Uh, 
My, my people also have a saying, which is uh, read the paper before you grade it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I, and I will, I will okay. read it when you officially hand it to me and I don't accidentally oh. come across it by, uh, by accident. Here you go. Right. Money stuff about spirituality. I, I'm not going to read this right now. That would be rude to, to make you wait on my decision while we're standing in the hallway. I mean, uh, I mean, as they say where, where I'm from, they say that, you know, um, accosting your professor in the hallway and then bumping into him and then asking for an A it generally means that the professor needs to give an A. You've heard that one? Oh, that took a turn. That took a turn. I I mean, in the generations that I've studied of your communities, I, I have seen that growth go from the, you know, you have to be deferential to being more bold and asking for what you want. That's, yeah. uh, it is so nice to see it in practice. Uh, I, I mean, I still have to actually read it but but your attitude about it your attitude about it tells me a lot about how you're going to present yourself in this paper oh uh, valerie i am um <laughs> i i'm very excited to read i mean it's so thick too like you even even double spaced cannot account for the thickness of this essay well, um, what can I say? I, I'm a thorough researcher and, um, you know, this is what I care about. And it's something that it's, it's very close to my heart. I, so, I, I'm just going to take a sneak peek at your yes, bibliography. Yes. Jenkins at the top. You referenced me right off the top. <laughs> of course. Uh, foibles over the spelling of words that matter to others. <laughs> nice, nice. Thank you for having paid attention during my lectures. Of course, you know you're you're one of the most influential teachers in my life. Um, something as mundane as words and things that we say, it's because of you that I I've developed and such a keen interest in it, and I owe you my life's work. Thank you. It, it is it is so nice to hear that. It's been a while. It's been a, a struggle for me. I don't want to put this on you, but, uh, you know, they say every year that you get a student who cares about lexicography and how words come together to form meaning. You're so lucky, so blessed to find someone and I appreciate that that's finally happened to me. It has been not since the start of my career that I have had this. So this is, thank you. Wow. Oh. I didn't mean to make this heavy. This is must be the, the bump on the head that is, yeah. Oh, yeah, it must be the bump on the head, right? Or or as, as my people say, sometimes, um, when there are emotional moments, it's better to just stay in them than run away from them. My people say the exact same thing. Thank you. I, I, I continue to be filled with gratitude for both the excitement of reading your work and the understanding on a, on a person level. You're welcome, um, Ms. Jenkins. And... I'm sorry no one else has said those things to you because you absolutely deserve it. You are undoubtedly one of the best teachers probably in the world. I like that. I like that. I'm going to write my own essay, my own self-reflection to remind myself of those words. Oh. oh, but I mean, I, I'm seeing your face. I am not, I'm not in a vacuum here. I'm seeing where you're at. And I, I want to ensure that I'm not bringing down your spirit to match mine. Uh, because I mean, before we bumped head, where were you headed off to? Oh, right. Oh, shoot. 
I think I was gonna go see Dr. Pankowski. Oh, Dr. Pankowski. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 I, she and I have the most amazing discussions on our breaks. Oh, it's great. Uh, please tell me that she is as animated in the lecture hall as she is w with a coffee. No, she, no? Uh, I, uh, that's why I was dreading it. I hate going and talking to Dr. Pankowski. I mean, sure, she's very accomplished in her field and she's had to break so many glass ceilings and I admire her for the struggle and everything, but she is just so boring. Really? She has, she has so many stories. Like, ah, yeah. oh, I can't yeah. believe, like, she doesn't talk about her kids. She doesn't talk about her horse. I don't even know her first name. It's Rabia. Oh, what a pretty name. What? what? I would immediately, like, melt 75 that would immediately melt 75 percent of the ice you know between her and and the rest of the class can can i uh, okay so i have an assignment for you okay. uh, it's not going to affect your essay but just try to connect with her the way that you connect with me ask a personal question <sighs> have you have you tried that before has has anybody tried to break through no, she's she's using boredom as a shield. Very intimidating, but I'm I must point out that Mrs. Jenkins, she only opened up to you, and that's a you thing, and that's a you thing that you did with words and lexicography <laughs> and combining words together to make meaning. So, I mean, I know that, I know you don't get the appreciation that you so truly deserve, but I want you to count that as a win. Thank you. You know what I'm going to do? You're on your way there. Now, are you, you're headed into lecture, I imagine. Yeah. I'm going to pop in. I'll pop in like 10 minutes after it starts. We're going to, oh. uh, we're going to, we're going to help somebody else open up to their contemporaries. <laughs> Okay, I just hope this doesn't affect my grade in Dr. Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I, I promise I won't point you out or anything, Valerie. I just <laughs> Okay. Let's let's see how this experiment goes. Okay, room two one eight, that's where it is. I'm heading yeah. there and I yeah. will see you in ten minutes, I guess. Great, that give, that gives me time to start your essay. See you later. And see. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you very much. Thank you. That was such a light and fun set. I loved it. Yeah. Yeah. I uh, I have enjoyed experiencing everyone's style as they come in and either bring with them their day or don't bring with them their day. Like, you know, because everybody's different and, and every improv moment is different. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So you, uh, uh, what I liked uh, off the top, I haven't had somebody leave the screen yet. So what I liked was both of us came in was like, oh, there's the agreement right away. It's about this for some reason. Yes. Uh, so that was a blast. Yay. Yay. I'm, glad, I'm glad you had fun. I had fun as well. I, um, I really liked that, um, you know, there's this uh, sort of rule in improv, don't talk about a third person. But yeah, we talked about a third person, but it was still about you. And Mr. Jenkins. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, I mean, gossip, gossip, there are a lot of rules in improv, which are don't, thou shalt not, do not do yeah. these things. But then you go, you try to explain that to somebody off the street who doesn't do improv. It's like, what do you mean don't ask questions? I need to know more. Questions are okay, <laughs> like in the right context, in the right spirit. And, and as long as both people are on side with it, I think. In the uh, right spirit. Yeah, that's important. Yeah. Because real life has questions. Real life has yes. and. and and art yeah. is and real life has gossip. <laughs> <laughs> so much gossip. If, if you're in the right if you're in the right group, you get lots of gossip. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah, so thank you. I I also had a good time with that. Now, uh you obviously as you said off the top, you're playing with two different groups and uh and one of them the Adam and Eve's, you're you're doing a fundraiser soon. Do you, are you willing to talk about that a little bit? 
we just finished the fundraiser. Oh, you just, oh, just okay. Okay. Um, it was from 8.30 p.m. Uh, IST to 9.30 p.m. IST. Um, okay. This is uh, a fundraiser to help um, uh, reach um, sanitary products to tribal women around our city in Bangalore who have been affected by the pandemic. Um, they don't have uh, any any sort of menstrual hygiene products that they can use. So um, supplying them these sanitary napkins would really make a huge difference to their lives and their health. Yeah. So we were raising money for that, which is a great cause. And it's something that is very close to my heart. All of our hearts at the Adamant Eves. That yeah. was a great show. Though. Yeah, we are great. Show. So uh, is your, is your uh, donation link still available for people if they want? Yes, um, yeah. I can. So, I can. Yeah. Yeah. We'll we'll put that in the link, and and that's uh, it, it's important that a we talk about it because not everybody is at the same place around the world, and we need to get uh, advocacy out there. But also, uh, if your link is still open, people can still donate uh, because if they can, then they should. I mean, well, donate and then come watch another show because the Advent teams are performing again on Saturday. So nice. Good. Again. <laughs> Good. Uh, I'm very glad. I'm glad that you that you're all together. I also like that you you state it as so far. You're the only all women troop so far. Definitely. I by you being out there, I can only imagine that other people are starting to come together. Other women are going to want to come together and do their thing too. So that and it won't ever be competition. There's always room in the in the community for more people with a passion. Of course, and improv is it, improv doesn't have an end. It doesn't have like it, it, it's improv. You're literally making it up. <laughs> what competition is there for things that you're making up? Yes. <laughs> yeah, uh, well, that's wonderful. And uh, and again, thank you very much for joining me, Bella. And uh, I look forward to seeing more from you, but I also look forward to uh, doing more sets. And next time, maybe we'll do some uh, some musical improv. Musical improv. Maybe. I would love it. I took your workshop and I have been waiting to do more musical work with you. So that would be my absolute pleasure to do that. So thank well, you. Well, uh, uh, fine, fine. I've uh, I've set this up there. I'm going to give you a beat and sing along. <laughs> boom, do 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 did I say? Did I say it was the best? Yes. It was the best. Yes. It was the best. Yep. We had fun. It was the best. Yep. It was the best. Yep. It was the best. Yep. We had fun. Woo! Uh, amazing. Amazing. Thank you very much. That is Aww. now going on my highlight reel. That's that's actually just going to, I, I'm not even going to have my face anymore. I'm just going to have the video of you doing this. Uh, well, that, well, dot com and it's just my face going, it was the it's best. <laughs> I agree. Please use it. Go ahead. Thank you. Thank you for permission. Uh, all right. Uh, we're going to sign off now, uh, but uh, I'll see you around the community very soon. We shall bump into each other soon. Bye. Yep. <laughs>